Hey, Hill. Hill here. Gaming. Good morning, Professor. Looks like it's time for me to go and look for that survey in spot. So, what I failed to do last night in the dark is use the tool you gave me. The survey tool. Alright, I'm in less than 40 yards. Alright, we'll go back up here. Here we go. Here's a spot. And we have this nice banner here. And a lantern, I tell you. They think of everything to bring with them. All right, Professor. I've marked out a spot to dig. Oh, I see. Fantastic. Looks like a most logical spot. I'll send the others over to get started right away. Check back in a few days, and we should have a good idea if we're going to find any results there. If you like, you could also help us to clear it out, which would make the work go much faster. Alright, well, since I'm here, I'll go ahead and help out. Goodbye, Guildmaster! Alright, Atar. Hey! We can use your strength as well. Professor? Greetings, Guildmaster! Any luck on the dig? Well, we did manage to uncover a few inscriptions, but sadly, we didn't find a way into Urkund. Here's some remaining fragments. We couldn't quite match up with anything, if you feel like taking a crack at it. As for the entrance, if you can take the survey tool again and try for another location, that would be helpful. Audion, Madras, and I are still busy trying to translate the inscriptions. All right. See you soon, my friend. <sighs> Not only is it dark, but it's raining. Um, I don't know if we're gonna wait for morning. Let me see. Where, where's this tool? All right, I still got it. 25 yards. Let's see. Let's go over here. Alright, good. Professor, I've marked off another dig site. Oh, fantastic. I'll send Kaya and Latoria to start on it and we'll join them shortly. It will take a bit of time, but this one shows some promise. Give us a few days and we should have some results. You could also stick around and give us a hand if you're available. Would make things go much quicker. Alright, I'll stick around. Goodbye, Guildmaster! do need to get back to Helgen soon. I just want to make sure everything is underway here. Oh, 
All right, so we made some progress. It's daylight again. Professor. Good day. So how did the second site fare? Oh, a bit better than the first. Found some interesting artifacts, but still no entrance to the ruins proper. I came up with a few more mystery fragments you can work with. But other than that, still chipping away. <laughs> ah, digging humor. The inscriptions I did see. make some mention about the mouth between the mountain, which makes me wonder if the entrance is near the mountain face. To that end, would you be willing to take another go with the survey tool and line up another site? We're still cataloging what we found. All right, let's see here. Goodbye, Guildmaster! Huh. So the, there's a mountain r right here. 15 yards. So it must be close by. Here it is. Where the professor go over here? Somebody really. All right, I'm gonna have to take care of that in a minute, professor. Another marker is ready for you. Glad to hear it. Wait, what? Over there? Are you sure? Well, I suppose we've exhausted the most obvious dig sites, so why not? We'll get to work right away. Check back again with us later. Or if you stick around and help, I'm sure we'd be on our way in no time. All right. And how are you doing? Mon monolith? No. Mouth? Oh, sorry. Just trying to figure this out. All right. All right, then. Since apparently we don't have anybody that's uh, going to clean up these bodies, just go ahead and transmute them. Somebody can pick the potato and have it for dinner. Alrighty. Let's see about getting in here. an entrance to Urkund. Apparently the old entrance was buried under a rock landslide, probably caused by the Red Year eruption and the earthquakes that followed. A passage leads directly into the main entrance hall of Urkund. It's all we've been able to do to stop Madras from running in all alone. He's so excited, and to think all this digging around and it's been right here, next to the tent this whole time. <laughs> we'll follow you, Guildmaster. Goodbye, Guildmaster. All right, what have we got over here? You ready? Here we go, the ruins. Would he call it Rakund? I don't, I don't know, he doesn't pronounce it like it's spelled. Hmm. Aha, it does lead to a main entrance hall. Fantastic. Oh, this is wonderful! I can hardly wait to see what awaits. This place seems quite well preserved despite the cave-ins. What can I do for you? Orion, you're joining us. Until we meet again. Uh-huh. All right, everybody's here. Well, let's go.
I heard a rumor that you met a psychic monk. You'll have to tell me the whole story someday. Preferably over an expensive glass of wine. Well, when you get the expensive wine, you let me know. Wow, look at all these eager explorers. This is this is amazing. All right, we don't know what's beyond this door, so I urge everyone to use the utmost of caution. Oh, well, I wasn't expecting this. Hmm. This is something. Uh oh, Falma. A true testament to the genius of the dwell. Do be careful, though. There are two Dwemersphere dispensaries over there. Ah, yes. And a Falma. I got your back, Guildmaster. Thank you. Easy there. We wouldn't want. Damage that. One day I'll learn a loop. Magic. All right, I'm gonna check down here. What was that? Oh, more Falma. You can't now get we'll Oh! Get him! You're not long for this world. That really hurts. There's another one. As far as specimens go, you're not the best. Easy there. Never come Is that all you? I'm gonna kill you. You will with a dress Get him. I'll put an end to this. Were you actually trying to fight? Who else is this using poison? All right. Staff of poison bolts. All right, Atar, you can stand down. Interesting. Seems to be a common room of some kind. Yes, it's a worker's dorm. They would house the workers for a large project in rooms like this, but I've never seen one so large before. Usually these dorms would house three to four master artisans, but judging by the number of beds, they must have had a dozen or more. Must have been a very large project they were here for. Well, everything seems safe enough. Let's keep looking around. Oh yes, it's so very exciting. I can hardly wait to see what it is. All right, I don't think there's anything else here. This is just a a dormitory. Come on, let's go. I notice y'all really don't need my help. I've never seen such a bloodthirsty group of explorers before. Just attacking everything. Check on this other side here before we go up the stairs. Uh oh, something's here. Look out, it's a farmer. Get him. Oh, what? Get it. There you go. There you go. Anything else back here? No. Hmm. no. All right. It's so no good. It's the up the stairs. Passage just caved in by the mountain face collapsing. It would take months to get it cleared, at least. We 
should explore the rest of the ruins first, and come back later. Careful here. Large pit of some kind. Please, There's no a column of some kind me. down there. Looks sloped enough to get down there safely. But how would one get back out? You could slide down, Guildmaster, and we could pull you back up with a rope after. Really? I don't see anybody carrying a rope. What else is here before I risk my life like that? Oh, look! What? Get it! Nicely done. Perhaps we can get back to better things. I tell you, y'all are just so bloodthirsty. So what is this here? Can't get through it. All right, then it looks like I am going to have to slide down. Mm, mm, mm. I really don't want to do this. for a minute. That was good. That's gonna be the end. Mattress. Yes? What is it? What do you make of this? Oh my. These are no normal Dwemer gears. These are key cogs. See how the teeth are underscored with a seemingly random pattern? This is used in combination with a number of other gears to open something. Let's keep looking and see if any more turn up. Bye then. Well, I hope we're not supposed to be going back down there, but let's. Did this open up anything here? It did. Come on. Would be trouble. Uh oh, we're right. We don't want to alarm you, but we're not entirely safe. We're alone. I'll put an end to this. Get Orion. I hope I'm not interrupted by that nonsense again. I see you used to be a swashbuckler. Looks like you're enjoying yourself. Come on. Oh, we got uh, somebody over there, too. Alright, we can't go that way. Can't really go that way, so it's this way. You're a bad catch. I threw that vial of poison. You're supposed to catch it. Oh, what's this? We do we have? Yeah, we don't have it. Well, at least we can get in here. Oh, Lord. Lords. Oh, there's a there's a switch. What's the something? Mm. I've got a really bad feeling about this. Can I leave here? Really bad.
Oh no. I'm supposed to go next. No! But this puzzle seems to be beyond my skills. stopped
All right. So I'm not sure. No, I still don't have what I need. I'm not sure what direction we need to go in now. That was some puzzle though. Like some sort of clockwork apparatus. Oh boy. Let me see. Uh, ah, yes. It looks like it's a lock requiring three cogs to open. That must be where that cog you found goes. There are probably two others elsewhere in Raccoon. You should keep an eye out for them. All right. Well, we have two. Uh oh, something's wrong. Oof. Look out. Apologies. Come on. In this way. What was that? Oh, oh, oh. This through. <laughs> nicely oh, done. Perhaps we can get the things. things. I'm pretty sure the third cog is probably going to be on the other side of that door. There's a there's a door here too. switches and we don't have anything to get past them. of nullification all right magic resistance that's <coughs> nice nothing there looks like nothing hidden up here Alrighty, 
here we go. Explorers. All right, let's see here. Uh oh, Hall of Puzzles. So oh, that's just what I need. a bit treacherous down there. I think it would be better if the rest of us waited here while you explored it. Oh, of course. Help, let us know. Oh no, is this another... Well, at least I have Giuliano's favor to help me navigate these things. journal I've been fooling with this confounded machine for days now no matter what I do I cannot seem to get all the parts aligned it seems that there are buttons that the buttons each control two or three pieces at a time and some pieces are controlled by more than one button I can't find a pattern at all there is no pattern to this at all I have found that if I leave the chamber, the puzzle will reset itself, which is a saving grace. It seems to be connected to the door. I am going to go down to the rock chasm for some fresh water and get some air, and maybe I can clear my head. Well, this just figures. I am certain that no other living soul will read this before I am dead, but it gives me some kind of solace nonetheless. I was down here at the water when it dawned on me that the switches can trigger a non-moving piece while its partners are still in motion, effectively alternating their movement. Since the buttons do not trigger pieces already in motion, if I am able to hit all the buttons while every piece is in motion, they should all converge to their correct location. I was so thrilled by this revelation that I set out to return to the chamber but slipped on some ice and I made my climb as I made my climb and landed hard breaking both my legs. Oh no. Well divines seem that I will be coming to you soon. Seems that I'll be coming to you soon. My entire body is numb from the cold and I feel I've been in shock for some time now. I can barely hold this quill to write, and my lantern gave up the last of its heat yesterday. I suppose I only have myself to blame. Oh my goodness, what a way to die. I'll take this journal. Oh, here's the lantern.
right, so apparently there, there is no way out from here. So we came all the way down here for a journal. Giuliano's favor. Yeah. Oh, Giuliano's is helping you as well. Thank you, Julianos. In fact, I need to pray. Excuse me. Julianos, thank you for helping me ascend and descend in these puzzles that have been thrown at us. I appreciate it. We never would get through this Wonder without your help. Let me also... Do some meditation, increase my magicka. You've done well. Thank you. All right. Oh, oh my. Excuse me. You mean oh my. Okay. Um, I guess the next step is to go through this door over here. We did. Oh, 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 oh get it. All right, thank you. All right, there's a lever. What did it do? Hey, watch it. Get yep. more care. Can I get through, please? Oh. Thank you. Alright, I'm not sure what that lever did. Oh, oh my. Oh my that? Right. that is quite a fantastic sight, I must say. Well, that is really quite amazing. Is it some kind of Dwemer sculpture or something? Oh, no, 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 my friend. Everything made by the Dwemer served a functional purpose. Form follows function, you know. This is a Dwemer puzzle lock. I've only seen one other before, in Morrowind, in fact. But nothing as large and complex as this. Oh, what fun! I can hardly wait to see what it does. Well, let's have a look and see what we can do with it. There look to be some buttons of some kind up here. Yeah, buttons. Let's take a look. Oh boy. So, would this be what he's talking about with everything moving? Oh dear, excuse me. In the journal. I'm in Paris, press one. Look out! All right. Beg your pardon. If y'all don't get out my way. Oh my god, this, you know what? You know, 
this is not working out with all y'all up here like this. is supposed to look like. Makes it hard since we don't really know what this is supposed to look like when it's completed. Is there is there a picture? There's not even um nothing on the wall. Oh, oh my. Mm -mm. Hmm? 
Good day. Oh, oh my. Oh, oh my. say we take a break get something to eat get some rest and we'll try to tackle this a little bit later <laughs> 